Susan. How can I help you? Hello, Susan. I have a problem with the room. This one, oh, I'm, okay, I'm, which I'm, room I'm, are you I'm, in? I've been here three or four times. When did you start using one-ply toilet paper? Um, we've been using one-ply toilet paper. Okay, because the last time I was here, it was two-ply. And if I'd have known it was one-ply, I would have recalculated. But I made a very horrible miscalculation. I I didn't use enough toilet paper, and my finger went through the toilet paper and into my anus, and so now I have some questions that I've got to ask you. Okay, what room are you in? I'm in 115. The party room, where everybody seems to be circulating around your room. Yeah, what's that have to do with anything? I've, I'm just letting you know, if you're going to have extra people... You said 115? Yeah. You are not in my hotel because there's nobody in 115 over here. Yeah, well, the guy next door in the party room said that I could go in there. He said it's kind of a free-for-all room. Uh, no. There's nobody in 115 and there's nobody next to 115. Well, I'm in 115 because the guy, the guy that I buy drugs from, he said I could go in here and shoot up. Unless you broke the door to get in there, No. Well, the handle was a little loose. I gave it a jiggle to test it, and then I gave it a push with my shoulder, and it opened right up. Hello? Step outside the room. I don't want to step outside of the room right now. I'm on the toilet. See, I don't believe you. Listen, hang on. Let me pull my pants up. You can't get in unless you have a key. This toilet isn't flushing right either. You're going to want to get somebody to look at this. Hang on. Can't you just come in? Why do I got to come outside? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Uh, Who is this? No, this is my friend. He's in the room with me. No, the, the needles, are these the clean needles or are these the ones that have been used? I don't know who you are. You just dragged me out the corridor. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> she just hung up. Hello, America's with Megan. This is Susan. How can I help you? Uh, hi, we got disconnected. If you're in 115 yes. without a room key, I'm going to call the law on you to get you out of my room. Why? So step outside because you don't belong there and you didn't pay for the room. I can, so step I can outside come, pay, I can so I can come pay for you. it now. I can come pay for it now. I don't want to have any problems. Step outside the room and let me I've, see where you're at. Your mirror just fell off the wall. So now you're breaking stuff in my room. It fell. I didn't break anything. It fell. It was like that when I got here. Step outside the room so I can see where you're at. No. I'm going to open up this window. I'm going to go. I'm going to go out the window. Hang on. Man, there's a bunch of holes everywhere. Susan? Step outside the room so I can see you. I don't... If you're being aggressive, and I don't know if I want to come out now. So, then you'd rather me call the law on you for breaking No, don't call the police. That's a waste of their time. I mean, you're doing drugs in my room, so that's... Oh, not yet or not, you to. interrupted me. So, step outside the room so I can see you. Reggie, don't break the TV. We're going to take the TV. Oh, sorry. That's my friend Reggie. He's visiting the United States for the first time. And okay. I, and I want to introduce him, in, I want to, introduce him to heroin. Reggie, Ooh. this is heroin. Wait! You put it, you put it in your veins, and it makes you Superman. Ooh. Okay, I really don't care. Step outside the room so I can see you. Do you want me or do you want Reggie? Both of you step outside the room so I can see you. Well, I need to put my pants on. He has his pants off. He doesn't have any other good veins. We had to put it into his thigh and into his toes.